We've just been talking about the the great resignation, or as some people call it, the great escape. What do you see as some of the triggers driving that change in behavior? Yeah, uh, it's an interesting question, particularly for uh, millennial and Gen Z generation, right? Uh, I happen to fall into the millennial uh, area, thankfully. And, uh, you know, 10 years ago when I was entering the workforce, I was hearing a lot of things about millennials are a bunch of job hoppers and we don't stick around, we're not loyal. And I think, honestly, it's part of the same conversation. It's easier than ever to find new opportunities. The internet has made it where you can democratize your ability to go anywhere. Um, and people can find you the same way, LinkedIn or any other tools that are available. Um, and so it's easier than ever to go find a place that you feel you will be able to align financially, personally, you know, emotionally, spiritually, you know, however it is uh, for yourself. Uh, and so I think, you know, the idea about the great resignation or the great reset is less about people leaving jobs that they dislike and more about people wanting to find something that's more closely aligned to where they're at. And especially with, you know, pandemic over the past couple of years and things like that, we've had more and more opportunity lately to make those moves. So with the tenets of conscious capitalism, what do you see as that ability and embracing those tenets of conscious capitalism that serve into the value proposition that you're looking for? Yeah, you know, I think for me, it's the, uh, this was alluded to very well in the session that we just got out of, but the idea of trusting people to do well and to want your business to succeed. So finding the right people and hiring the right people requires making sure that there's alignment between their personal purpose or their sense of purpose with the overall goals of the role that they're going into and the direction that the company is going to. Uh, I happen to have the good fortune of working with a certified B Corp called Benevity, and its purpose is very aligned to mine, which is helping make it as easy as possible for other people to do good um, by giving their time, by giving their money, et cetera. And so I think being able to empower people to find that sense of purpose in their role, and I would clarify by saying that doesn't mean everybody knows exactly what they want out of life, but empowering them to ask the question and figure out, is this a step in the right direction? Giving them the opportunity to explore that in your organization is really what helps you be successful. Mm -hmm. And we've talked about that millennial generation as, as you had mentioned, but we've also gotten the workforce. We still have the baby boomers. We still have Gen X, Gen Y, Gen Z. I'm not sure all the gens that we have because we've got so many people that are still looking for that fulfillment of purpose. So how do you see the common threads of all of those generations coming together? Mm. That's a great question. That's a tough question that we could explore uh, for a while. You know, I think the interesting thing is that this is almost like a we're reskinning the same issue that I think other generations have had across, you know, boomer generations, things like that. Like we all want a fulfilling career. We all want a fulfilling life. We want to feel like we're driving meaning. And what we found in recent generations and the way that the business world works now is that there is more and more alignment between how individuals align themselves with their career. And so there's less of a delineation between your personal life and your professional life, right? And so I think businesses have to be able to adapt, understanding that multiple generations have multiple perspectives of uh, how they engage with their employees and creating a space for them to be successful regardless of their personal views. But again, I think you still have to have that core tenet of trusting people and hiring the right people to be in the organization to begin with.